Mate Rev, welcome. Today is Saturday, Saturday, 9th of March. Boy, this month is really moving. <laughs> and the year is moving too. The year is going very fast. Now, where have you been, Trev? Look, <laughs> I haven't been actually had the urge of picking up my camera to do any filming. And um, yes, it's nice and sunny outside. The sun is really shining on my face pretty well. <laughs> so um, it's going to be a very hot day. It's going to be 38 degrees Celsius. So that's going to be pretty hot. Some place it's going to be 40, 40 degrees. 40 degrees in Swan Hill today. Swan Hill. That's my old recording town. <laughs> I used to do a lot of recording in Swan Hill. So bit of a shout out to all you folks in Swan Hill, Victoria, out up there in the Murray. <laughs> so where am I going to do today? I'm going to Albury today because I've got to, I've got to have my ear investigated. My left ear has been bleeding, actually. Well, I've had a lot of bleeding, um, so I'm not just sure what's happening. Um, could be the, because I've got a grommet tube in there. And uh, it could be the factor, I don't know, it could be the hearing aid that might have done the damage, I don't know. Um, so it's got to be investigated. So it's a little bit of a concern for me. So um, I've got to see my ear specialist over there in Aubrey and so he wants me to come in today. So, and of course this weekend is long weekend. It's Labor Day weekend right here in Victoria. I'm not too sure about other states. Um, New South Wales has theirs in October, I think, and uh, while we have ours in March. And um, Labor Day is some other states. I'm not too sure who. Well, it could be Tasmania too. I'm not sure. But anyway, and um, no, I haven't been filming for a while. I haven't been well really um, the last few days. Um, I think it was, well, it's Thursday, Wednesday and Thursday, I haven't been well, really. I don't know why I've had a bit of a bug. Go, well, there's a bug going around. <laughs> so, um, but I've got over it. Thursday, I, um, Thursday wasn't a very good day for me. I mean, didn't, I didn't sleep very well. And Friday, I picked up, which was yesterday, um, I felt better. Yeah, so, anyway. So, it's going to be a hot one, and um, so I've got to do that today. Go to Aubrey and um, then um, come home and have a bit of a rest because they've got I got I got to do another trip to Benalla, so I got to take some clients back to Benalla. So that's what I got to do. So got a big with the big day today, and of course um, this weekend uh, Sunday I'll be taking Peter out. Uh, we I don't know where we're going, but we could be going somewhere and. Uh, and of course, Monday is a holiday, so I'll probably take it easy on the Monday. Anyway, so anyway, I hope you're having a great day too. Uh, and in this video, I'll be um, putting up um, some clips that I did over the past, probably the last couple of weeks. I'm a little bit behind in my videos <laughs> uploading, so um, you'll enjoy some of those. And uh, anyway, hope you're having a good day. Catch you after. Mate Trev, welcome. Today is Sunday, 25th of February, and welcome. And uh, it's a beautiful sunny day outside, and of course, I'm taking Peter out for a little bit of a drive today. We're not going all that far today, so uh, we're going to have lunch at a place in Wangaratta called a Snitz. Snitz, it's Snitchels, chicken snitchels and chips. Um, and other foods so um, we usually go to that in Aubrey when we every time when we used to go to Aubrey so now they've opened one up here in Wangaratta so we're going to try that out today and uh, and after that we'll see where we'll go after that we'll go for a little bit of a drive somewhere after that so it's going to be a nice day and um, and uh, I want to thank all you people who've um, Anybody who's tuned in to that internet radio, um, Orange New South Wales, that's the one where to go to um, with Doug's selections. Thank you, Doug, and I'm glad you liked it. I'm glad you um, liked that video too as well, um, me singing the beer drinker's waltz. So, um, 
and uh, so anyway I've had I enjoyed your program too so what's it not and listening to all the folks around the world playing singing and a bit of a shout out to all your folks over in Africa South Africa is that what I believe and Germany as well too and different other countries overseas I've been listening to your songs yes very nice very good it's good to hear so anyway and um, so we're just going to chill out and uh, see where we're, what we'll do I'll be having a great day Mate Rev, welcome. Today is Monday. Start of a new day, start of a new week. Yes, and also it's the end, the last week of the month as well, of February. And it's also the last month of our season of summer. Hmm, so we're gradually coming into autumn. <laughs> so, um, anyway, and uh, it's 26th of the February. The, the, this month is really moving very fast and of course with it's um, 29 days in February this year so it's a leap year yeah leap year so we've got an extra day in the month of February <laughs> so um, yeah so look at that now what's missing there's something missing oh yeah I've got my little stereo yeah, you guessed it. Where's my jigsaw puzzle? It's gone. <laughs> Why? I had to dismantle it. Well, it's rolled up anyway. It's not dismantled completely. It's rolled up, put away. Now, the reason I did that, um, I just don't get time to work on it. <laughs> and it's really tiring to do it. Um, Every time when I'm on the jigsaw, bit the jigsaw puzzle, I'm there falling asleep. <laughs> All the time. I know you know how it is with jigsaw puzzles. I know some people reckon it's boring. Yes, it's boring. Some people don't have the patience for it. <laughs> well, I've done alright so far, but you know, I need a little bit more space in my lounge room, so in my living room. So uh, I had my stereo there. So they're all over here now. Yeah, my stereo and my record player. I play my records every now and then. Yeah. So I'm um, just doing a little bit of tidying up and a little bit of rearranging. It's good. <laughs> so I hope you're having a great day so far. It's a morning and it's warming up. It's been a coolish in the morning. It's been quite nice, quite pleasant actually, really. So um, of course yesterday now, I didn't do any filming yesterday. Um, I took Peter out. We went, where did we go? We went to Snitz, yeah, the Snitz uh, restaurant in Wangaratta. Um, we usually go to that one in, in Aubrey, but um, in Wangaratta they opened up a new one. So, uh, so we went there for lunch yesterday. So then we went to Millawa, Millawa, uh, Millawa Bakery Cafe. We went there to have a cup of coffee. Then we went to Glen Rowan. Yes, we went to Glen Rowan and have an ice cream yeah, so we went to the Providor and our good good friends there at Providor and um, so we went there had an ice cream and it's a bit of a catch up too with the good friends so that was our day yesterday <laughs> and of course last Saturday um, I uploaded my video um, on Trev's Bushland Adventures that's up now check it out Yes, check it out. It's awesome. That's Craig's Hut. Craig's Hut, yes. Now I've got a few things I want to talk about Craig's Hut. Now I did see some clips of the movie of the man from Snowy River and um, it looks a little bit different from what I've seen really but of course that hut was um, replaced twice. It was burnt down um, I think around about 1992 or something like that 91 or 92 it got bent down and then it was rebuilt for the film in 2006 that's the man from snow river of um part two so the first part was filmed in about 1981 so i believe now i'm i did mention the actors in it um Sigrid thornton kirk douglas and tim tom tom Bellinson. 
and I uh, must do a little correction. I don't think Jared Kennedy, he might have been in there, I don't know, um, but there was Jack Thompson as well. Jack Thompson, he was a good actor, so he acted in that, and, um, and there'll probably be other other actors, but I can't think of their names. But Jared Kennedy might have been in there, I don't know. Um, I really don't know. So, anyway, Jack Thompson, he's a good actor. And uh, so it was a good film. And I've got the video somewhere on DVD, but I can't find it. I've got to find it and watch the movie. But I did see it, some clips of it on YouTube, actually. Um, just so some of the scenes on there. That was, really, that was quite interesting to watch. So, uh, the man from Snowy River, yeah. So, but you know, parts of the film um, were filmed at different locations, not only Craig's Hut, but I believe there was a stockyard somewhere around the plains area of the high country. Uh, I wasn't very familiar with that. So, um, it could be elsewhere, it could be around King's Hut Spur. Um, it could have been filmed around there as well. So, there is a stockyard there somewhere. So, um, so there could have been other scenes in other areas of the Craig's Hut that it was filmed. Mm. So, but anyway, there was there were a lot of other areas that I didn't actually walk to um, out around the outside the hut area complex because um, there is a camp area, a camping area. Um, so there could be a stockyard there somewhere um, where they. Uh, stock the horses, they put the horses in and um, they break them in and things like that so I really didn't see that so anyway I'll catch you down the track Mate Rev welcome today is Thursday 29th of February yes an extra day added to the month of February and of course it's leap year leap day I guess <laughs> so the 29th anybody having a birthday on the 29th of February today I want to wish you a very happy birthday 29th of February yes um, anyway now today it's very early in the morning um, it's about half past five in the morning yes because I've got a job to do now anyway and uh, we've been for some hot days very hot um, so bushfires are still going out of control and on alert over in the western districts of Victoria in the central area and western area so um, we're pretty safe here in the northeast uh, but we still we still need to be vigilant we need to still be alert just in case but, you know just hope we get some cooler days to get some rain we need some rain <laughs> mm. Anyway, I'll catch you down the track. Mate Trev, welcome. Today is Tuesday, 5th of March. 5th of March, yes. Quick March step. <laughs> and it's also um, first month of autumn as well. It's autumn time. Yeah, yeah. Goodbye to summer, unfortunately. Mm. Okay, now I'm gonna, what I'm going to do, I'm going to sing a song, I'm going to sing a brand new song. I have been busy uh, recording and um, recording some beer drinking songs. I've already recorded um, two dozen cans in the fridge and a song called Fill Up My Glass, mate. So they've been recorded, so I'm working on some new songs. This is a brand new one actually. Um, I started writing this one, I don't know when. <laughs> Well, um, yeah, it wasn't, wasn't very long ago. I think I started this in February but in uh, 2024, yes. So, anyway, I'm halfway recording this song, and um, it's not true in my life. Um, it's called Smoking, Drinking and Fishing. It could happen to anybody in, in, this, in this life. And, um, of course, I don't smoke, and I never have. And I don't drink, I don't binge drink. I don't mind a beer every now and then, once in a while. I don't mind the taste of beer. <laughs> and um, I don't do any fishing either. My, my, I used to when I was a teenager, when I was, when I was with my dad and my mum. They all, we all used to go fishing. So um, that was it. But these days, I don't do that. <laughs> anyway, 
I want to do this one dedicated to all you people, all you folks who likes to get out there and smoke, drink, and there's nothing better than go fishing. Here we go, smoking, drinking, and fishing. to a lot of people um, like smoking and drinking and fishing <laughs> so um, I hope you like that song anyway I'm halfway recording that song at the moment so it's sounding pretty good so far and, um, and there's lots of other songs yet to do um, there's one I've been working on it's called The Pub With Free Beer uh, it was written by the, the late Fred Howard actually it was written actually well, he wrote the song, but he got the idea of a mate in uh, a pub in Roxbury Downs in South Australia. So um, he got the idea so that he wrote, then uh, Fred wrote the song. So um, something I'm working on um, as well, the pub with free beer. <laughs> anyway, and look, I must apologise, I haven't been vlogging very much and filming very much. Um, not much to vlog. I've uh, been pretty busy with my work, uh, with my transporting, of course, I've been getting up very early in the morning, yeah, 4.30 in the morning, and then got to leave beyond the road by 6.30 in the morning to pick up some people. <laughs> so, um, 
that takes up to about nine o'clock. Nine o'clock in the eight in the morning, then I go home. So that's what I'm doing today. So I'm resting now. <laughs> Done me driving. And uh, anyway. Now I'm in Albury. Just arrived in Albury at the West uh, West End Plaza. I think that's what it's called underground in Albury and um, I'm pretty early actually so I'm just gonna walk around I got my 10 o'clock appointment at my ear doctor so um, pretty quiet around at the moment so uh, just gonna kill a bit of time and uh, I won't do any filming in the city in the town because I don't usually film and there's a lot of people around in the, in the supermarkets and places so um, Anyway, I'll let you know how things went. Well, now I'm back home. Yes, back home from Aubrey. And um, I came home. I got home about lunchtime. So, um, been in Aubrey this morning to have my ears, uh, which had been bleeding um, over a period in the last few days. And uh, that's been investigated. That's fine because of the grommet tube. It's um, in the ear that's probably causing it. So I've got to go back. Uh, he wants to be back there next weekend as well, next Saturday, to um, have that exchanged, the, the grommet tube, that is. So it's going to be a little bit of a local surgery. Yes, yeah, so put me on an anesthetic. And it's only a day surgery, so um, it should be fine. We'll see how things go. I've got to put eardrops in during the week. Um, so I've got that. Got to get those. And uh, so things will be right. Anyway, it's a really, it's a very hot day today. We got up to about 37, 38 degrees, I think, around about um, Celsius. That was pretty hot. It's very hot outside. That's all. So anyway, I've got to go to um, take these people back to Banala now. So I've got more travelling to do. <laughs> more travelling. So um, so I've got to do that job. So uh, I'll catch you. And uh, I'm going to finish this video. And uh, I'll put it up tonight. So please, and uh, yeah, and uh, I'll be back sometime. Um, I won't be vlogging as much as I had been, so I might be away for a little while. And with Trev's Bushland Adventures, um, I'm going to have a bit of a break from that as well. So I won't be doing any adventuring this month. Um, I've got issues with my vehicle and also my hip. And my hip is, um, I've had a lot of trouble with my hip lately. Mm. Oh, it's one of those things. Anyway, and uh, I hope you enjoy the rest of your weekend. I shall see you soon. Bye. Fred Harmony. Peace. Bye. You never know what I get up to next. <laughs>